This is Robert Kraft, and I'm coming to you live on SNN Live, and we're at the LD Micro Invitational 2018 in Bel Air, California. With me right now is Neil Chan from iGen Networks Corp. It's a publicly traded company. The symbol is I-G-E-N on the OTCQB. Neil, welcome to SNN Live. Thanks, Robert. It's great to have you on. So, for our audience, let's start off with an overview of the company. Well, iGen Networks Corp. is a software service company, and we essentially develop software and services and data for consumers in the automotive segment. So it enables a father, a mother to better understand what the teenager is doing behind the wheel. So let's get into the history of the company. When did you start the company and how did you develop to where you're currently at today? Well, we started iGen about six years ago. Uh, we've been acquiring various assets and platforms and then evolving those platforms to enable ourselves to be able to deliver services uh, through our dealer channels and most recently uh, through our relationships with carriers like Sprint. So tell me a little bit more about the technology. How does it work? Well, it's a device and software that gets activated in the vehicle. And in uh, most cases, it's preloaded. In other words, it's activated in the vehicle before the consumer purchases the car. And in that uh, situation, uh, the um, service then is provided to the consumer when they drive off of their new car and uh, are able to access information from their smartphone in terms of not only where the vehicle is, but setting up alerts in terms of if the vehicle is being stolen, if the battery is going low, if, the, if your teenager is going hang out in areas they shouldn't be hanging out in. Uh, it essentially provides peace of mind for the family. So what about your, your software makes it potentially unique? Well, you know, we've designed the, uh, our algorithms specifically to deliver these services without um, harming the vehicle. And um, most importantly, the, the technology is being developed targeted for the consumer. Um, and uh, that's an important element in the consumer automotive space. Because right. it's not part of the OEM process. It's, it's, a, it's a retrofit? That's right. Yeah, it's put in as an aftermarket product. Um, and it's, made, uh, it's designed in such a way that it's self-provisioned. So the user gets a password, a username, and they then are able to access that information. And what's the target market size that you're looking to uh, penetrate here? Well, there's, there's approximately 17 million cars sold this year, uh, new cars. There's uh, more than 162 million cars sold in the last 10 years. So, uh, there's 50,000 dealerships across the U.S., about a 60-40 split in terms of new car franchise and pre-owned. So the market's pretty substantial. And what's the competitive landscape looking like? I mean, are there other competitors out there that are have similar products? I mean, I know with the iPhone, you find my iPhone and you can track mm -hmm. where your friends are, but this is a little different. Yeah, we have, um, in our dealer channels, we have the traditional uh, Lojack, for example. That's uh, one of the competitors. Um, but in terms of where we're heading in evolving our algorithms and our software to better understand driver behavior, um, we do not see a competitor yet. We ex is believe we'll be one of the first that will develop these services that are vehicle-centric, not iPhone-centric. Gotcha. So what's your background? How, how did you get into all this? I spent 10 years with Motorola. Uh, working on uh, many interesting projects, but I was involved with data with Motorola in the early years. My last uh, assignment was I uh, ran the Asia Pacific group uh, for Motorola uh, for the cable modem business. And then from there, um, uh, worked on a few startups. iGen is my third um, uh, in developing broadband wireless services and fleet management services. So my background is, I, I prefer to be calling myself a marketing person. So uh, from what you can tell me, what are some of the company's growth drivers moving forward? Well, really the key growth driver for us is our partnership and relationships with um, our carriers 
who uh, in particular we announce our sprint relationship with the IoT factory which really opens a whole another set of channels for us in the B2B space, uh, which we're very excited about. Uh, we expect the business to be scaling very aggressively uh, in the next several years. And where can our audience go and find more information about iGen? iGenNetworks.net. That's www.igennetworks.net. My name is Robert Kraft, and I'm coming to you live on SNN Live, and we're here at the LD Micro Invitational 2018 in Bel Air, California. With me again is Neil Chan from iGen Networks Corp., publicly traded company. The symbol is IGEN on the OTCQB. Neil, thank you for joining me today. Thank you, Robert.